Hello guys, so today I will show you what's the defining episode of Logan Logan History Season 14. Well, yes, it's the episode 5. Today I will show you what's the wicked best uh, anime entertainment. So yeah, that's why. It's not for ado, uh, before I start, and if I do not do, if I ended it for the, for, if I ended for the new episode and uh, to make it a new season about uh, this, the Mind Logan History series, well, the series will be stay, stay active for wait, for wait because it, uh, due to was the, because due to my vacation trip, uh, with my family, because, yeah, I know they say this so far. So maybe I took a break from my channel because for my channel for a while me after trip. So I know to say that I we have to do the other side other platforms, maybe maybe I, I do that. So or etc. So now for ado, let's get started. And any of you who doesn't know about the Ricky Pass Enemy Entertainment, here's a program. It is, was an American production company located in New York City and known for the seasonal television specials, usually done under the stop motion animation. Ring and Best is the stop motion productions are running on by recognizable by, by the virtual style for the style of a doll like the characters with separate separated body parts when you would just about a shift out of snow using the animation technique called Addy Magic. The only one of in Studios Animation was our source body, but Japanese animation companies such as the Toy Animation, Mom in the Production, Mochi Productions, and Top Craft. Rink and Bass was one of the first Western studios to outsource the third low budget animated te television and film productions to animation studios in the countries. The, other, the others that, all, that already purchased animation outsourcing included the to Total Television and the, uh, the King Fisher Sadicade. TV in New York City, the J. Wood Productions, and Hatterbury Productions in, in Los Angeles, in California. 1960 to 1968, here is a local concert first to make it best in the entertainment name, Faircraft International, uh, I mean, um, Faircraft International Limited. Sorry for that. There's a word that uh, Faircraft Productions, Faircraft International, and Arthur Rick. Record Journey Associates at the Black Text. Bottom, they were the three round with tingles, two gray, two gray, but the one each has the left and right on the long parts, and a one black on the middle, and one on the bottom, out of under the between two. Between two. The bottom of the round with tingles is awarded to the divisions of aircrafts incorporated with the Black Text. Here's the logo. Nineteen sixty eight to nineteen seventy one, in nineteen sixty eight to nineteen eighty seven, it changed it over to the Rinkin Bassey Productions. There's a blue blue for the cold tingle and rather there are two two circles, one blue on the top and one light blue on the bottom, representing it to the uh, combined combined letters of a low R and B. Here's a logo. Nineteen seventy one in nineteen eighty nine, in nineteen eighty five to nineteen eighty nine, as the currently name was the Winking Bass Entertainment, I mean uh Winking Bass Anime Entertainment. In two thousand to two thousand, the logo was modified. Here's a logo in nineteen eighty five when in the with the scene with the Pictures logo, also which is seen on the closing credits and the Thundercats. So 
title of it, but the video was uh, you had to keep it like let's keep it slow, I guess. So, so that's all for the season fourteen of local history. So coming soon for next season was season fifteen of my local local history series after the my vacation trip with my family. So, so that's today's video. Make sure to stay safe. Take care.